wondrous, eternal Guelph I haven't been here since I was a boy. Be wary. Elves likely wait in ambush. The frail elves do not concern me, Necromancer. Our forces are strengthened with every foe we slay. Don't be too overconfident, Death Knight. The elves must not be taken lightly. We shall see. Bring forth the prisoner. Where is the entrance to your land, Elf? You will never enter Quel'Thalas, Fallen Prince. The woods themselves protect our borders, and the enchanted Elf Gates protect our capital. Your precious gates will not stop me any more than these trees, little Elf. Bring up the meat wagons. We'll make our own entrance. <laughs> the energies of this place are strong. Kill the elves. Level their structures. This location is perfect for your base. It'll be a pleasure. The undead are advancing. Alert the sentries. Alright, the beginning of this battle is not going to pose any sort of a problem. Our uh, troops here are just going to go nuts and start slaughtering everything. Oh, they're already haunting the gold mine, so we're fine. Destroy it! My life for yeah, yeah, yeah. It's building the Acropolis in the same place that their town hall was. No one orders now, uh, Arthas is still, well, rather weak, um... The rest is dead. Even though he's reached level 3. I mean, he was level 10 before, so... <laughs> It's going to be a little while before we get him up to the point where he's going to be the beast that he needs to be to just roll through here and start slaughtering fools. Uh, I'm going to have to take a, a little bit of a trip around here to survey the land. I don't really remember what this map looks like, so i got to be aware of what directions uh, I might be attacked from. This is more like it. Ah, uh, at last. Okay, that's one of them. Uh, we're gonna have to cut down those trees or something to to get that uh, get through that area. It's probably the same thing here. You are not welcome here. I am Sylvanas Windrunner, Ranger General of Silver Moon. I advise you to turn back now. It is you who should turn back, Sylvanas. Death itself has come to your land. Do your worst. The Elf Gate to the Inner Kingdom is protected by our most powerful enchantments. You shall not pass. You shall not pass, huh? I wish only to serve. I bow to your... Okay, Sylvanas... Well, she's not dead yet, but she will be soon. Frostmourne. Haha! <laughs> but, of course... The way that hero units work in this game, she's not dead. She will resurrect. Alright. Where shall my blood be spilled? Summoning is complete. I will be done. My life for Those can just set up gold and I can now uh I gladly obey. Speak, fool. I can build necromancers. Now, we had necromancer units before, but they were, of course, um, just, uh, what do you call it? Units that we picked up without actually, um, without having to earn them. They're just sort of, oh, we f you found a necromancer. Ah, at last. Ah, at last. My life for Nezul. Altar of Darkness. I will need one of those. I'm definitely going to get Arthas killed. Aw, oh, Temple of the Damned. Halls of the Dead Graveyard. And this is an Necropolis. So I don't have nearly what is necessary to get this going. So I'm just going to start building ziggurats in defensive positions. And that'll be good. Speak, fool. 
Arthas has apparently lost whatever scrap of humanity he had left. He's trying to kill off the elves. Now, the elves were... Back in uh, Warcraft 2, the elves were part of the alliance against the Horde. And they did fight on the side of the humans. They did fight on the side of the alliance. And it's... I don't know. You'd maybe say without the, el well, the elves, which managed to build some of the more advanced technologies and stuff or whatever that they were using to defend themselves against the Horde. Maybe uh, humans would have lost that war. I'm going to need to build a few more of those. And I guess it was understood at the time that Elves were essentially good people, but I'd say he doesn't care anymore. What kind of uh, hold this Lich King actually holds over him? So, uh, it's not really made exactly clear. I mean, is his own mind, is his mind his own anymore, or is he just uh, sort of, I don't know, uh, uh, just some puppet under the control of the Lich King? Never really going to get that answer to that question. I'm not going to open these pathways up until I feel like I have the proper uh, setup to go and do so. Huh, <laughs> bunch of bodies stuck on sticks. I don't have enough ghouls to really, uh, to really defend this location, so I'm going... I'm avoiding setting up a situation where I do actually have to defend my position. Once I get these ziggurats in place, though, and I turn them into spirit towers, then, you know, they'll be a little bit, the place will be a little more defendable, a little defend itself in a way. Still early in the Undead campaign, so we're going to be missing a lot of the technologies that we really need. Or would really want. Uh, that one's done. That one's done. We have enough food. We have enough to just avoid an upkeep. So we'll be alright as long as we can... Uh, I'm intelligent about what kind of units I build. Not too many necromancers. We don't need a lot of necromancers. And I probably won't be building too many more meat wagons. Hopefully I can get by with the ones I have. Definitely going to end up just building a bunch of ghouls, though. Maximize their... My ghoul technology so I'm... Not screwing around with weak ghouls, you know. This is a little bit weird that... Ghouls use... Ghouls are used as a sort of... Peasants or peons, in the sense that... They're going to be harvesting the lumber. They are going to be doing all that kind of stuff. We do have the acolytes, which oh, we can can we build abominations? If I can build abominations, that would be a nice uh, nice boost to my military here. What else can I build? Temple of the Dam. I can't actually get banshees right now, but I will build this. And I don't really need any more necromancers, but I'll build this just in case I have to replace them. Alright, let's think about getting in the position to advance. Get these guys in the position. The new ghouls that I am constructing or training... We'll go there, along with Arthas. What is it now? And we will be good to go. Give us a sec. I want to see if I can build an abomination to go with them before I finish building out any more ghouls. I am recording audio, right? I think I am. A 
come on. Come. Summoning is complete. Summoning is complete. All right, that's I guess worth doing. Nope, just meat wagons. Okay, I'm just gonna build out that one more ghoul. Until then, I can just uh. Must be. <laughs> no, don't. Ah, oh, crap. Screwed that up. The dead shall serve. <laughs> Corpses. What does the shadow do? I'm just uh tamarin' down these so I can get at this uh thing up here and buy whatever it is that they have. I guess I don't really need the lumber for these guys. But um might as might as well, you know, take a few more seconds to chop down the wood than it would be to speak fool. just blast it down with this thing, but you know, why not? Frostmorn hungers. What is it now? <laughs> there we go. Tread lightly. Lord Arthas, the creatures of the forest are also resisting our invasion. Of course they are. Uh, at last. <laughs> the dead shall serve. Research complete. Aha! Skeletons! No one orders me around. Can they get through? That's a no. Gotta be careful. Skeletons don't last forever. Now, that's enough harvesting lumber for you. Skeletons aren't really all that useful as units. They are fragile, and they have a short lifespan. But I can use them as fodder or for exploration. So let's... Alright. So I know what I'm heading into. These uh, skeletons are going to get killed without doing much damage. So let's get everybody prepared. I don't have any ranged units aside from the meat wagons. Oh, the necromancers I guess count. But I will form ranks anyway. Yes, they do. And Arthas will take point. They'll sort of maintain that formation while advancing, although they will wander around a little bit. Oh, time for a killing. <laughs> Got them all. Didn't take any damage. Not significant damage, at least. These guys can go and eat corpses to regain health. We'll be fine. Frostmorn hungers. Well, finally. Uh, I guess might as well destroy these. They don't do anything, but wreck them anyway. This is more it's another gold mine. Frostmorn hungers. I bow to your will. I can train one more acolyte without uh, without going in the high upkeep or low upkeep. So I might as well do that. Oh, ranged units. 
Looks like Arthas has gained a level. What? Seriously? Arthas got pinned behind the damn meat wagons. <laughs> Tried to have him heal. This is more like it. You will know heal that um, ghoul that was taking a lot of damage. Didn't happen. My life for Nazul. I gladly obey. Where shall my blood be spilled? I bow to your will. Get up in there and do that. Ha <laughs> uh, you're gonna be stuck here doing nothing until that thing gets finished. No build another crypt over here so I can start building that crap out. Uh, so I can replace my ghouls from a closer location. What is it now? Speak, fool. I did lose a meat wagon. Frostmorn hungers. Keep that in mind. This is more like it. Ah, at last. Hmm. <laughs> Go ahead, run away. Trying to summon skeletons. There we go. Now there is an ability that Arthas has in this game, which I guess you would say it's not absolutely different than what we were saying the necromancers have in the ability to do, but it is different enough that it... Um, the necromancers are capable of summoning skeletons to do fighting and all that kind of stuff. But for the most part, the skeletons are no substitute for true for true um, units. You're not going to want to take a, a skeleton as your main line of off offense inside of a battle. What you're going to have to do, though, is use them as a sort of like what I was using them for, like a supplement for the fighting that you're actually doing. Your true units, that kind of thing. Well, Arthas has the ability to actually do like a proper resurrection of... Once I get another level or two, I'll be able to do it. It'll summon all of the dead bodies in the area to sort of... Sort of wait, hold on. Did I get that right? Ray 6 dead. Yeah. Ray 6 dead units in the area to fight for the Death Knight animated units are in invulnerable. Now when he was a human, this sort of worked in the sense that friendly units would simply be resurrected. And they died, you bring them back to life, everyone's cool, everyone's happy, everyone is healthy. Eh, not necessarily the case when it comes to when it comes to uh, the Death Knight Arthas' ability. They will die, but it's more than enough to upset the tide of a battle, really. Get up there and destroy stuff. What are you hanging back for? Is this thing actually attacking something? Oh, it is, yeah. Meat wagons attacking the peasants. <laughs> Get over there and kill. Can't decide on who to kill here. 
Okay, I got the spirit tower there. I have a maximum number of uh, 50 now, but I don't really want to go over 40 because I don't want to have to worry about the upkeep. So I'm going to keep it low as long as I can to make sure I get all the gold and lumber that I need. There's Sylvanas again. Haha! <laughs> I guess the skeletons really can help turn the tide of a fight here, too. Like, taking out Servanus here might be difficult with my uh, normal units, my grunts, so to speak, just taking all the normal damage. What does the shadow do? The dead shall serve. Haha. <laughs> No one orders me. Since they're gonna end up dying anyway. What does the shadow will? This better be good. In truth. Just What does the shadow will? Bring up as many skeletons as I can. And advance them forward. Now there are quite a number of them, so maybe they actually will be able to do some substantial damage. But I'm being realistic about this, they are pretty much just fodder. Kill! Kill! Oh, they have a ballista. Not going to be too worried about what happens to them. Time to advance forward. There's a gold mine over here, right? Yeah. Alright, yeah, they were all taken out. Though I think they did some pretty good damage. What is it now? No ghouls remaining, huh? No ghouls remaining. Thy bidding, master. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's still there. No one orders me around. Uh, yeah, both necromancers survived. Oh, and the other meat wagon survived too. The restless dead await. Speak, fool. Thy bidding, master. Huh. Oh crap, they're be still being trained by uh By this crypt. I bow to your will. Unsummon that one. I want him being trained out of the other one. You actually get some resources back from unsummoning a building. Our gold mine is nearly empty. Yeah, that's why I got other one set up. Planned in advance, fella. Planned in advance. Alright, now it's just this one. Oh, you know what? It's... Yeah, whatever. I thought maybe that they were coming from that... That crypt, but no, they were coming from that one. I was just being an idiot. And, uh... Build another crypt anyway. Yeah, it's getting there. It's got 900 some gold left, so I'm not too worried about that. Oh, there are my uh, ghouls. Should have one more on the way.
Bring us up to 40. I got enough gold. I guess I really shouldn't worry too much about upkeep at this point. Stop harvesting lumber from there. It's so far away. <laughs> Whatever. Is I wish only to serve. Yeah, sure, sure. My fate is sealed. Yes, Master. Our forces are under attack. Oh, that ballista's come to attack us. Do the same thing we did earlier. Two there. Should be another one or two bodies here. Oh, there are four of them. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> oh, they're despawning it. Take care of what these guys are doing first. My life for Just send them over to mine that one. Now, was this the same ballista that attacked us? Well, I guess so. It's not here. Right, move our skeletons forward. They're just sort of dying. <laughs> Short lifespan and all. Eh, they're not going to make it. Nothing. Don't need that one anymore. Must have lost a ghoul during the last battle. No one orders me around. Except for me, of course. Nope. It's rolling away. It's not up there, I guess. Alright, time to advance. Nope. I bow to your will. No one orders me around. Frostmourne hungers. Ah, uh, did Sylvanas uh, res last time we fought her? Fought there? No, I don't think she did. Meaning she's probably waiting for us up ahead. Gonna have to be a little bit careful. Finally. Gonna have to be careful. This is more like it. Now, Frostmourne. Now, uh, just get the meat wagons taken out the tower. Did I lose a necromancer during that? It's all going great. Oh, they've been slowed. I gotta get rid of this thing. It keeps summoning up these uh, these archers here. Up oh, there's Sylvanas again. Up, oh, up. No. 
Get over here and kill that damn mage. Oh, Arthas is down. Ah, uh, jeez. Oh now I have to worry about a... Now I have to worry about Sylvanas launching a counterattack. Oh, he didn't die, he just never left. <laughs> oh, no, meat wagons, get out of there. <laughs> I might be able to salvage them. Oh, they're following it back, but they're not attacking it. <laughs> it's going slow enough. They'll probably find themselves marching into a fight against a bunch of ghouls by the time they get here. Um, I doubt it, but maybe Arthas will be in position by then, too. Look how the one made it back. This one's probably going to make it back, too, it looks like. Okay, it didn't quite go as planned, but it takes Sylvanas down again. And I lost a meat wagon. What does the shadow will for the Lich King? Yeah, see, look at it. It's time bars running down. Yep, oh, wrong location. Get in the position. Come on now. I wish only to serve. My fate is sealed. Must be Maybe I should build another meat wagon to replace that one. Speak, fool. Nope, they didn't make it. Damage something! Yeah, they don't have long to live. <laughs> the dead shall serve. Yeah, sure, sure, whatever. My life, Onezur. Ah! Looks like I guess this is the biggest uh, portion of enemies around. Thy bidding, master. I lost a meat wagon. Not the one I thought I would lose, but I did lose one of them. This one survived, but it was damaged. It's getting repaired now, though. It'll be alright. Siege units in these kinds of games are always sort of a weird thing to deal with. Because on one hand, they're very good at de destroying structures, and even in certain cases can be good at attacking units, but it's not always the case that it's useful. I mean, uh, meat wagons can be rather susceptible to damage by melee units. They get too close and just deal damage. Also, they tend not to be too well armored, so one unit gets close, it's usually enough to take one out without some sort of backup. Got Arthas back, though. We're good. We are good to go. This is more like it. It's moving slow because it's stupid ghoul stuck in his way. I'll do this down one meat wagon, but with a ghoul to replace it. Frostmourne hungers. Finally. I guess I took out maybe half of what they had going for him. Oh, no. Nope. I caught him in the middle of an attack. Oh, 
restless dead await. There we go. Speak, fool. What does the shadow will? What is it now? Everybody get south. Ah, Start last. busting things up. No one Ha ha. Where's that meat wagon? Okay, I think... I mean, destroying this is definitely something we have to do, but the gate down to the southeast is really what we need to get at. I guess they don't really have any defenders left. Ha, <laughs> look at that. They are trying to... trying to save it. <laughs> Running away while holding a sack of gold over his shoulder. Run on ahead, skeletons. I want to see what's down there. Ooh, look at this. Ah, fountain of mana. Not really useful. But, you know, whatever. Did I lose a unit? Yeah, I lost a unit. I'm going to consider us to be in a good enough condition to just move on from where we are. Rather than taking the extra effort to build up defenses. Although I will, um... Shall my blood be spilled? I will jump forward and haunt the gold mine just in case I have to later. It'd be easier to set it up. What is it now? Come on, meat wagon. Tread lightly. There we go. Frostmorn hungers. Sure it does. Ah, at last. At last, you ordered me to go over there. Frostmorn hungers. Um, uh, how should I do this? Speak, fool. You will know endless torment. This is my life. Finally. <laughs> I have a couple of skeletons, but they won't last long enough to be of any good. No one has me around. Take out that priest first. Can't have that sack of crap healing everybody. Haha! <laughs> People who played the game World of Warcraft would know who Sylvanas was. It's the same character. Just at a different point. In the the series history. Finally, we've reached the elf gate. Press the attack. Let none survive. Yeah, sure, whatever. Sylvanas is out of the picture, so without a hero unit, they might have a hard time defending this place. It might be a good idea to make sure that I take out anything that could be potentially um, 
like this altar of storms or whatever it's called. <laughs> well, that's that's just a barracks, but it would be a good idea to get rid of that in any way. Yes, of course he has. Oh, no, I did have another meat wagon on the way. Uh, retreat. Of course. Of course. Thy bidding, Master. To have one ghoul, though. <laughs> My life for Nezul. I'm not going to worry at all about upkeep at this point. So, I'll set rally point there. We're far enough, we're deep enough in that we just make a quick rush towards the end of that. We'll be fine. Summoning is complete. I'm not even going to bother bringing back any more of, uh... In fact, even these ghouls. I want them fighting, too. It'll be fine. Well, this episode's going on for a long time. That's what's, of course, going to happen. The deeper you get into the game, the longer the missions are going to be, so that's the longer the episodes are going to be into. Okay, we're about to... Uh, we are about to hit upkeep. Oh, there it is. I bow. Of course, with upkeep, you're only getting seven gold and lumber per unit taken, so your efficiency does go down, but it's still withdrawing. Notice it's still withdrawing ten from the mine, but only taking seven into our inventory. So it is less efficient, so you want to spend less and less time in a high upkeep setup, but, uh, you know, it doesn't really matter at this point. We'll be all right. In fact, I'm going to have so many guys that I'm not going to be able to um, control all of them at the same time. So I'm going to send them over in two groups. Arthas isn't even here yet, so he'll be part of the second group. What is it now? Sometimes, brute force is just what you need. <laughs> it's actually getting quite a few of these guys, too. Our forces are under attack. Oh, of course they are. Oh, full force. All right, moving forward. Um, I'm probably going to win this exchange. Was Sylvanas here? Yeah, yeah, my guys won that fight without without my interference. For the Lich King. All right, while you're attacking. The rest of you move forward too. These guys will focus on taking out the units. The next group will focus on taking out the buildings because they have the meat wagons. Take out all the casting units. Oh, 
lost my upkeep. Eh, plan's not really going exactly to plan, but that doesn't matter. Get over there and kill that damn ranger. I think I'll need to take out the, um, I guess I'll have to take out that gate. But for now, I'm just going to wreck the human's ability to, the elves' ability to fortify or defend themselves. These guard towers first, I'm going to have to take out. Meat wagons can do that, though. There, the altar of kings. I got to do that to make sure Sylvanas doesn't come back. Alright. Their defenses are gone. And we've pretty much clenched victory now. They don't have any way to defend themselves. It's all just about wrecking things. The boom. Fall back to the second gate. Fall back. The elf gate has fallen. Onward, my warriors. Onward to victory. Ha ha ha.